say I trust you, Edgar. Edgar, compi, ¿dónde estás? ¿Otra araña? No, por favor, ¿eh? Otra señora araña gigante que me... Que me quiera matar. No, por favor. Dinerito. Bueno, poco dinero, pero bueno. Receptivos. A ver. Dinero, pues que poco dinero tengo, madre mía, si no voy a avanzar. Bueno, por aquí no se puede ir, no, no. Bueno, entonces es por aquí. Bueno, pasemos por aquí, otra vez otra araña. Lo veo venir. Ahora será una abeja gigante, ¿no? Me lo veo venir. Me lo veo venir. No sé por qué, pero me veo venir una abeja gigante. Vale, este... A ver, ¿qué me das? Adicto a la adrenalina.
aquí. Cuando vaya a aparecer una recarga de salud, apa aparecerá una energía en su lugar. Pues no, no me interesa. No es lo que yo espero. Venga. Ah, oh, otra vez a matarlo. Sí, venga, a ver, ya no me puedes fallar. No, no supongo qué. <risa> una segunda vez. Faltaba eso. Se buguearon una segunda vez. Thanks for the hand. But I had it under control. You can tell. I found the plan. The local call it La Orchid de la Vida or something called it. Get this back to Calico, squeeze it out, and maybe we have ourselves a way to turn this around. 
I'm sorry I got you into this. Getting your ass out of the fire has kind of become a habit. Edgar, you can't keep doing this forever. When those ticks attacked the manor, what did your father do? Run? Nah. He kept on squeezing the trigger. That's what he did. People like us don't get tired, Jesse. Even if you're lucky enough to live long enough, you'll soon realize there's nothing waiting for you. There is no normal for people like me or your father. And I was uh, naive to think there might be some normal for you. Anyway, now that just about everyone else in the Institute is dead, I figure you and your daddy are gonna need all the help you can get to build things back up again. Well, first you give me those pretty flowers, then you get all emotional yeah, on them. Edgar, you ain't gonna try to kiss me now, are you? You little shit. <laughs> Bueno. Acabamos con la oveja bug. God damn it. Harold's here. Backstabbing witch, you ratted us out! Dr. Blackwell, I know we've had our differences, but this... For your information, I had nothing to do with Mr. Harris' sudden appearance on our doorstep. But thank you for confirming how little faith you have in me. Now, I don't presume to know how things work for you, gentlemen. But I can assure you that Calico wasn't built on broken words and betrayed confidences. Women in my position don't have that privilege. Now, I assume you have the plant? We do. Good. And there are clean syringes and alcohol swabs in the lab. Five minutes is all we need. <laughs> Mr. Gravener is looking for you, sir. He's in the basement with your father. Come on, William. I've seen you survive worse. feeling that someone's squeezing my brain oh, there's some thoughts in here that, that aren't mine oh i see her jesse oh no you must stop her before wait wait i see Sai. dickens she's in dickinson I need to get to Dickinson. Tough old bastard, he's turning it around on her. It's gonna be a hard sell to Harrow. Gotta try. You keep an eye on him. Keep your hands off that switch. Mm -mm -mm. Mr. Harrow is waiting in the briefing room. He's...
Assistant Secretary Harrow, sir. Agent Rentier. And Dr. Blackwell brought me up to speed on your father. Sir, we... I know. It couldn't have been easy. His shadow will loom large over us all. Please accept my condolences on behalf of a grieving nation. And try not to wallow in grief. It only leads to blunder. And this country desperately needs success. Aside from the news of your father's tragic demise, I've also briefed the Assistant Secretary on the successful destruction of Felicity's leech factory in McCallum Sawmill. That and a penny will buy me a cup of warm piss, Doctor. No one is safe while that crazy she-beast and her army of freaks are on the loose. And do you have any idea where she is? No. Actually, I do, sir. We have intel that she's currently in Dickinson. What intel? Can't say, but it's 100% solid. Great. You can head for Dickinson after you get back from Kingston. Kingston? There's a case containing some very sensitive information there that I need picked up. But, sir, the Dickinson lead. There's at least three interstate railroads there. It might be a part of Felicity's transport. Very well. You, you there. What's your name? Only? Virgil? Only? Do you know your way to Kingston, only Virgil? Uh, with all due respect, Mr. Assistant Secretary, Virgil is our top engineer. Uh, he is not fit for field action. I don't give a watery shit about his curriculum fucking vitae, Doctor. I'm funding this circus of yours, and I want those papers back now. Mm. I'll get them for you. What do I need to know? 